Shout out to all Israel. I'm giving all praise to y'all. Bashim Yashah, Bashim Rechokadash, Bakhtad, Dabon, to the apostles and elders at the Grim Acre Mil Great Millstone. Over well, peace, blessings, and salutations. To the elect is pushing this word, truth, and sincerity. Salutations. Um, you know, uh, this is uh, the season where it's starting to get cold. And I got these <coughs> these heathens that look like these gooks out here training in the snow. And, uh, uh, I want to equate it to what what uh, brothers do at Great Millstone, the, you know, uh, well, really the elect and the one third, you know, because we don't really know who's chosen right now, you know, we we we, we, we try our best to uh, make our call in the election sure, but we <coughs> so lucky we can't tell who's who. So really, um, we're training right now. We're training. We're training in the snow. Okay, and that training. I mean, hey, uh, um, what we do? We go out in the highways and the byways. We put up shows, brothers that can fellowship. We fellowship, all right. Fasting, things of that nature. It's cold out. It's starting to get cold, and by the looks of it, it's going to be. Pretty much getting cold quicker than it did last. <gasps> Excuse me, quicker than it did last year. So, um, you know that all means you know building it, bundling up. Okay, taking taking different precautions. You know, some brothers uh, has a lot have have a lot of knowledge on the herbs. So, uh, um. They, you know, get in, get into the herbs, you know, so that so brothers don't get sick, things of that nature. Um, you know, this is what it's, you know, this is what it's all about. There's seasons to, you know, seasons doing this work. You know, got fall, spring, summer, winter, and all those different seasons come with come comes with uh, different battles. You know, while how we're out there in the elements, a lot of. Uh, People will say, "Oh well, y'all y'all going out th y'all going out there when it's cold." Uh, but people are not going to listen to you. People are not going to wake up. Well, that's far far from the truth because there has been brothers who've woken up in the uh, truth, who've heard this word out on the highways, in the hedges preaching this word while it was snowing or it was snow on the ground. That doesn't give us an excuse not to push the word. All right, there's guys that will tell you that doesn't talk about what it's talking about, and I'm gonna get the scripture first one I'm gonna get meaning you know what we're doing what we're doing is fishing for the elect of course all right and I'm gonna get that scripture man there's a particular person I've heard come out their mouth and they said uh, basically broke down the scriptures wrong I'm gonna get it Romans 12 and 1. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, for the mercies of the Most High, that ye present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy and simple, acceptable unto the Most High, which is your reasonable service. Okay. That's our reasonable service, man. Uh, putting our bodies on the, on the line as a living sacrifice. The sacrifices were done away with as far as um, sacrificing animals, you know, to... to for our sins that we went off, but now we're the living sacrifice, um, us, because the Lord died for us, for our sins, so it's only right, <laughs> it's only right, <laughs> that's a, that's a good topic, it's only right, you know, um, uh, that we go out and preach the word, rain, sleet, hail, snow, sunshine, we all feel like it, sleepy, Tired, hungry. No matter what, we're supposed to come out on the highways and the high byways. So, like, so I'd be seeing some brothers go out more uh, on weekdays. You know, you know, brothers, me and other brothers, we, we go out on Sundays. Some brothers go on Saturdays, and it's, it varies, man. Luke fourteen and twenty three, and the Lord said unto. unto his servant go into out into the highways and the hedges 
and compel them to come in that they may that so I can that my house may be fulfilled may be filled so the highways and hedges is where um we're outside we you know you pick places that you know particularly you know often we pick um places areas like a downtown or a, or a place where there people can be uh reached um where there may be stores around parks whatever the case may be highways and hedges you know not literal highways <laughs> like a literal highway you know just an allegory you know but it's gonna starting to get cold so it, it you know uh, things switch up as well you know um it might be too cold to go out a, a you know um might be too cold to go out it might be a snowstorm okay different places might be covered up too so you can't go you have to a scriptures call scripture says we're pil we're we are pilgrims so we got to be ready to adjust and it's it's not a very easy thing to do i'm gonna say that you know some brothers actually like the prophesying prophesizing in the cold once you start you know reading you start getting you know you're in the spirit it's not that bad it's actually not that bad you know just like you get your body moving um doing work outside working out with things of that nature it's not that bad you uh get your blood flowing get circulation you see you uh um, um you know you don't really and, and everything is mental so you don't really focus on how cold cold it is and let that and let that um because that's just satan trying to knock you off man you know this is the book of matthew 24 and 20 pray ye not pray ye that your fight be not winter neither on a sabbath day so hey you know it's interesting times can Oh, weather can be a factor in things. This is uh, First Peter one thirteen. Yeah, I want to say too. You know, uh, you know, in my testimony. I'm um, I'm uh, I, I can get down, <laughs> so to speak, man. When it's cold, you know, I when a lot of times, you know, training for for sports, you know, for wrestling, I I go out and run when it's cold. Bundle up. Go out when it's cold during the night because it gets colder. It gets more cold and windy um, as the night falls, and we know uh, during winter, the winter season, fall season, um, it gets uh, daylight saving, so it gets dark around five, um, five or um, six at the most, whatever. You know, so hey, I, I, I'm used to it. I like it. I kind of, you know, you know, it's like a something that's uh you can overcome you know it's you know like training training you know in, 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 in the winter you don't really get sick you know this is first peter 1 and 13 wherefore gird up their full or oh, sock wherefore gird up the loins of your mind be sober and hope to and for the grace that is to be brought unto you as a revelation of Yahweh Shai Mashiach. So we're supposed to gird up our minds. So, you know, being ready to do this work any chance, any time, you know, any chance. It's our reasonable service, you know, and this thing, you know, we can't take breaks. You know, we can't take breaks um, when you just just because they get cold because you have certain guys that uh, believe they're doing the work of the Lord. But when it gets time, it gets cold or the weather gets uncomfortable, they stay in the house or they stay inside. You know, they, they don't come back out until the weather is totally nice and, and and fitting for them. That they don't, you know, they can wear shorts or they could, you know, people are, you know, out and then and having fun because the weather is nice. No, man, this this thing is not all about being nice, feeling nice and feeling good. Uh, there's a name for them. Uh, uh, I'm going to get that scripture in season, not out of season. Is there, uh, 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 there's uh, there's scoffers out there. What the hell? In season out, so there's uh scoffers out there who say 
were snow dummies, man. So they're big ass haters, man. Snow dummies, ain't nobody listening to y'all. But they're bug outs. So who who's really the dummy? Let me get this and I'm gonna end it, man. You know. Cause at the end of the day, hey man, we're doing the right thing. All right through the spirit. This is a uh, Second Timothy four and two. Preach the word. Be instant in season, out of season. Reprove, rebuke, exhort for, exhort with all long suffering, in doc, in, in doctrine. So we do that in season and out of season. In season is when it feels good, when it's hot, it's warm, it's perfect weather, not too hot, not too you know, spring, where where it's not too too scorching hot, not too cold. That's perfect weather. Out of season is where it's real, real cold. Inclement, inclement weather. You know what I mean? That's not talking about how you feel. That's not talking about how, uh, uh, if depending on uh, if it's fatigued or if you're in the mood. That's not what that's talking about. In season, not a season, man. Knock it off. You know, certain guys are just completely bugged out they want to change every scriptures because because they're no part of they're not part of us anymore that's foolishness man all right so yeah man i just want to uh, put that lesson make that lesson because uh about that time all right hey lord let me come out and get out of here soon man time goes by keeps going by quick like it is and we can um get closer and closer to the end man you know that's all that's is all what this thing is about you know kind of uh uh lord was edifying all praise to you how about shimmy i'm shy by shimbo kakadash divine to the apostles and elders at great millstone group of well peace blessing and salutation to the elect especially in this word with that shalom